Hey, welcome back to Triple R, Random Rick Reviews. This is kind of a first impressions of Minecraft Dungeons. Maybe second impressions. But I streamed it a little bit the other day. I saw it was on Game Pass. I was like, well, I'll try it out. Um, so far, I think it's a pretty good game. Uh, it's pretty easy to get into. I think it's definitely easier to get into than main Minecraft, which I really don't know too much about as is. I know what it is and, you know, how it works. But this is more like an action RPG. It's kind of lighthearted. Um, your adventure hub here. So you level up. You unlock new things. Like I got this. <laughs> this how. Uh, I guess it's equipped here. And you have your storage chest. Oh, my inventory. I don't have anything in it. Fishing pole. My armor. Like I said, I didn't know too much about the game. Uh, I went into uh, my mission select. And the first thing I did was go over the towers. I don't know why I went all over here. I was like, hit towers, play through the tower mission, um, beat up boss, the first boss that came. And that was pretty fun. It was a, it was a cool little thing to do. Uh, the main story, I, I guess, is over here. Uh, you start in the Adventure Hub, Squid Coast, and then you go to Creeper Woods. So Squid Coast, uh, the tutorial goes, uh, goes on. There's a nice voiceover when the game begins from this lady. It sounds really good. Explains the story. And you pick your avatar. You don't create your avatar. <coughs> you just pick one from uh, quite a few. Quite a few choices. Uh, Gameplay is pretty simple. Uh, we'll go ahead and get the creepy woods. Creeper woods. Uh, default. Of course everything looks like a Minecraft game. Very blocky. But... From what I played, it's fun. It's like it's very light. Don't seem too deep. You can enchant your weapons. See that guy's in the, the box. Oh, here we go. Decree, all free folk are now enemies of the Illager Empire. Somewhere in these woods, a caravan is transporting villager prisoners to labor in far-off lands. Find the caravan and stop the Illagers, or there's no telling what dreadful doom will befall our villager friends. I do like that lady's voice. I think it sounds really good and fits the game. So you got this roll here. Uh, picked up a rocket. You have arrows. Pick up armor so you can get loot, which is nice. Because I am a fan of like Baldur's Gate, Dark Alliance, and games like that. Set A to attack. Got her gems. It's also nice has an arrow that tells you where to go, which is always nice for pathfinding. So you're getting lost for 20 minutes. So here's my inventory. I have this hunter's armor. I have stats over there, plus one health, plus ten of your arrows bundle. And I like that a lot about you know action RPGs, picking up loot, getting better loot, deciding what you're gonna use. Got a common bow here. Uh, during the towers, you'll pick up weapons that are just within the tower, so they don't carry over. And we have this fireworks arrow, and some boots of swiftness. So let's do a let's do a fire arrow here. Well, regular arrow, just right trigger. Don't need to eat that apple yet. That's the fire work arrow. I picked up wolf armor. So let's check that out. <laughs> Alright, can I equip this? Plus one L, 20. Eh, I don't think I need that. I think this is better. So just hit A, smash all the enemies. Howl emote. Let's see if I can turn this up a little bit. The music's not overbearing, which is nice. But it's there. Got to level up here. Enchantment point. And we'll go in here. Enchant. Uh, maybe our bow. 
No, we can just salvage it, never mind. Whoops. Oh, why? Poison cloud. Sure. Nice. A extra damage there from the poison cloud. So even though I'm not a huge fan of Minecraft art style, this game is pretty fun. For like a Game Pass uh, free game. So we've got to rescue this villager here. Find the caravan. Checkpoints. So the poison doesn't hurt you. That's good. Now uh, you have your map. Oops. Just down. Tells you a good overview. So this game has everything that action RPG has. That's all the uh, comforts, I guess you would say. So a pretty good first impression playing this game. Simple to get into. Always fun to loot, and you get to attack things, which is always fun. So uh, a lot of these arrow guys can like they can like overwhelm. Try to get to the next part here. I'll try to find the caravan. And as far as I know, there's no Minecraft building. Like, you don't make anything. So, I don't know if that would turn the Minecraft fans off or not. But, for someone like me, who doesn't play a lot of Minecraft at all, really, you know, got the whole thing, this is pretty fun. And I guess it could lead you into, like, playing the other Minecraft games. I know, I think Minecraft... Is it's called Legends is also on Game Pass right now. And Minecraft itself. Got some spiders here. And the web you the rush. See my heart down there is getting a little low. Yeah, health potion. LB. Ah, this guy. I was hoping he dropped an apple. Um, we're gonna go ahead and heal. Firework arrow there. Bring some visibility. Okay. Yeah. Nice. So that's cool things like that. Just gonna walk by everybody. Nope. I don't know if that poison arrow is worth it or not. Because if it doesn't kill him, it's kind of a not too useful. Oops. Like I said, I can't really rate the game per se because I haven't played it too much, but as a first impression, I like it. And I probably will play more of it. So that's a, that's a good thing. A lot of games you play and you want to turn off instantly. Wizards here, got this TNT we're gonna throw here. Oh, not the least. <laughs> That's an area effect for damage. So this is Minecraft Dungeons. I would recommend it. Just a if you want a casual game. You know, it's not very, uh, it's not like Dark Souls or anything. At least not yet. I mean, I'm like level 3 or whatever. Maybe it gets really hard, I don't know. But thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are.